the fifth charge against Hillary Clinton is her raids against free speech. Clinton wanted to ban negative lyrics from songs, thus introducing parental advisory labels. Clinton wanted to ban M-rated video games. Bart Peterson, former mayor or former city king of Indianapolis, Indiana, also had the same idea as Clinton to ban M-rated video games. And I can remember the negative memories when Peterson reigned as mayor of Indianapolis, Indiana. During Bill Clinton's presidency, or during Bill Clinton's royalty, the Telecommunications Act of 1996 was signed into law on February 8, 1996. And you know why Bill and Hillary work together as spouses to destroy the freedoms of the pawns. Title II from the Telecommunications Act of 1996 talks about broadcast licensing. By being licensed, you have to be a slave to the government to fear what is right according to the licensor and to fear what is wrong according to the licensor and licensors care about money and about power and those are tyranny. How am I going to give my whistle-blowing news against the government to the public for the sake of freedom and for the sake of truth if the government puts too much regulations? And how am I going to broadcast my other announcements to the public if the government puts too much regulations. Title V from the Telecommunications Act of 1996 talks about parental domination to media. Parental ratings to television was introduced to declare negative influences to specific television episodes and to specific movies to brainwash juveniles. I thought that parental ratings to television were cool, but thanks to the parental rating streak break of my favorite shows by declaration of mixed ratings to each episode. I hate parental ratings. V-chips were required to televisions in 1996 and in future televisions to read the parental rating and slash or to read the content to block a television episode or to block a movie, thus destroying juveniles' fanatism. A favorite series and slash or of favorite celebrities, real or fiction, and manufacturers of media devices are plagiarizing parental controls in media devices by worshipping 
parental ratings with content as absolute truth. According to me, the examples of obscene material are character building lessons, parental ratings of any type, brand censorship, legal information slash terminology, and pride from people in authority after their successful bullying. And do you really want children to learn to be hopeless by the examples of obscene material that I mentioned? Rumor has it that Clinton has plans to control the internet by censoring negative influences, according to Clinton. The sixth charge against Hillary Clinton is offending John Stossel by the words of needing more regulations. Stossel had lunch with Clinton for approximately 30 minutes, and Stossel ended the conversation with Clinton quickly when Clinton said to Stossel that the United States needs more regulations to make the United States successful. But as a libertarian, Stossel said, no way. As you know, regulations create tyranny. I can imagine the future when Hillary Clinton becomes president or queen of the United States. More personal information would be invaded. People in authority would get special immunity like Clinton regardless of taking responsibility for bullying. Communication would be invaded by prohibiting sedition against governments. So many businesses would be regulated by legal bullying. My suggestion and John Stossel's suggestion are that people should vote a libertarian into office or into royalty so we can stop living in misery by Clinton in the future. Prosecute Hillary Clinton from presidency or from royalty to make United States stronger. My name is Adam Branca and I am against Hillary Clinton and I approve this editorial.